Hello, I'm Daniel, and welcome to the Moon Project. We here at the Moon Project are continuing in our series of videos uh, of uh, information, education, inspiration, guidance, advice, and following up on a previous video um, where I talked about the gates of tears. Uh, that's always open. That's that's never closed. And um, we pray in slichas, in the prayers of uh, penitence, the repairs of. Uh, uh, of repentance, of sorrow, and remorse. It says, May it be the will of the one who listens to the sounds of our cries that you collect our tears so they are not lost. Save us from cruel decrees, for our eyes are turned to you alone. A great prayer, beautiful and poignant. It makes us feel good. It makes us feel comforted, knowing that regardless of the situation, options are not closed. There is still hope the gates of tears are always open. Is that always true? Unfortunately, we know all too well that uh, people have prayed, poured out their hearts, poured out their souls, cried bitter, heartbroken tears to no avail. What do we to feel when we cry and cry and seemingly our prayers are not answered? There is um, there's a story I'd like to bring at this point. Um, from the father of a kidnapped Israeli soldier, Nachshon Waxman. Uh, Nachshon was uh, kidnapped, held hostage. Thousands of Jews all over the world prayed on his behalf, crying out to the Almighty, pouring out their hearts. They uh, did not succeed in saving him. Uh, he was brutally murdered by uh, Arab gunmen and Arab terrorists. Um, a number of secular Israeli uh, establishment types asked Nachshon's father, you prayed, we prayed, nothing happened. God did not listen. Doesn't that bother you? Are you not angry with God? Are you not angry at, at, at your ignored prayers? Mr. Waxman um, looked at them, answered in a calm voice, yes, we prayed. We begged, we asked Hashem to listen, to save my son, Nachshon. He listened. He listened very intently. He weighed the request. He could have said yes, he could have said no. He said no. Hashem listened, and his answer was no. Sometimes our prayers do not elicit a positive response. Um, the answer, unfortunately, is not always in the affirmative. They say, God answers all prayers. Sometimes the answer is no. And um, it's a little hard to live with sometimes. But we have to, because that is the will of God. Gam even this, is for the good. We'll be doing more videos along these lines. Please come back. Please come back. Please watch. Please learn. And until next time, on behalf of the Amuna Project, I'm Daniel, and thank you so much.